OK, I'm starting out on the Photosynth website. If you look over here, we've got New Account, Sign In, and Create. Create is for making your own Photosynth. New Account actually gets you to sign up for the whole pho Photosynth thing. But before we get there, we need a Windows Live ID. OK, to get a Windows Live ID, if you have one, well and good. If not, you have to go to the Windows Live Sign Up page, which is here. Microsoft Sign Up Live dot com. It's the usual routine. You can use any email address that works here. You'll obviously be sent an activation code. Put in password, retype the password, put in a phone number, etc. And then finally, there's down at the bottom here a captcha. Okay. You may or may not want junk mail. And then down to I accept, and this is a button that you'd run. Okay. I'm not going to step through that because I've already done it myself. Okay. After that, you're into creating an account on Photosynth. Which again is similar. Windows Live ID, password, sign in, and that gets you in there. OK? So that's what it is. The one other thing you may be called upon to do is you will have to download Silverlight and install it on your machine. So for that, you do need administer privileges on your home machine. You do have to install software because creating a photosynth is quite processing intense. And so Microsoft would like this actually be done on your machine before the thing is uploaded. OK, that's us done for the moment.